Dr. Bahu Chair. Um, and um, firstly, I wanted to mahalo the testifiers that came. For, um, I'm personally uh, wanting to listen to hear what their ideas are. Also, I wanted to mahalo uh, Member Paulton as the area rep and and we're happy to, I'm happy to support any of the ordinances that you brought up. And if we can uh, take up any of those issues in our uh, committee, our personal committees, um, I'm willing to do that. I'm also wanted to mahalo Chair Lee for putting forth this uh, resolution um, and us following up on it. And, and also to you, Chair, for uh, arranging a meeting in Lahaina where we can uh, hear more uh, from the individual res. Um, my question was uh, to our OCS lawyers um, and considering the emergency proclamations, what I, I know we can continue with ordinances, but what falls under our purview so we can be really succinct on how we can actually help as a council. Um, I know that some of our authority is being suspended right now. So uh, maybe which pathway forward would be most ideal for us to move in. Um, and also chair, uh, I think, you know, Mr. West brought up the, like the bypass. So that would be under the state purview. So if we could somehow invite the state to to come in and be part of uh, our discussions or, or at least have them present or, you know, they can, or, or at least listening in into our meetings. Um, uh, one idea that, I, uh, that I've heard and people have called is for those residents who maybe want to build back the same and who might uh, have those plans, the, the planning department still have those plans uh, in the in their departments, maybe they could instead of going through all the permitting process, just continue those same plans, and then maybe that can kind of help to uh, speed up the process. But those are just some of my um, comments. Thank you, Chair. Thank you, Member Sanenti. If you would like to provide some comments to Member Sanenti's questions, thank you. Uh, thank you, Chair, and thank you, Member Sanenti. Uh, Member Sanenti, to the extent the um, governor's emergency proclamation, the seventh, and the mayor's uh, third emergency proclamation uh, suspend laws. They have suspended laws um, to the extent those laws might impede the response to the disaster, as uh, so they don't prevent the council from enacting laws uh, to respond to the disaster. So I think uh, you're free to consider any particular ordinances that you'd like to consider in response to the disaster. Thank you, Remy. And Member Sanenti, um, I'm going to reach out to some of the state ledge <clears throat> house reps because they have created a task force to invite them into this committee so that they can also hear from the community before they decide to make legislation for themselves. Um, thank you. Chair Lee. 